are at the Woodlands Bay Primary School. The project you are seeing here, we call it a model school garden with solar as a source of power. We are piloting different hydroponic systems in this garden. The systems we are trying out here, they are the low-cost hydroponic systems which can easily be adopted at a household level without a limitation of income. The technologies we are using here, we are using simple techniques. Whenever someone comes in this garden, there is one or two, three systems one can easily say, oh, I can do this. Many people when they come here, they are like, we can't afford this. It looks like something out of people's uh, 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 incomes and, and, and knowledge. So, the, the model school garden is trying to address those critical questions of affordability. As you are seeing here, the techniques we are doing here, they are simplified hydroponic systems. We are planting in, uh, using bamboo. We did it in, uh, in PVC pipes. But again, we are trying to do it in bamboo trees to show that people, whether you have, you don't have money to buy the PVC pipes, you are able to do it in bamboo trees. So, the message out here is, hydroponic is adoptable and you can do it. To the learners, it has given them a chance to put what they learn into practice. Here there is mathematics. Here there is uh, physics. There is an any application of any subject you have ever thought of. Chemistry is being applied here. So for learners, it's time for them to apply what they are studying in classes. So that's why the, the model school garden is so important for no, learners, communities, and all the, the general public.